guys, welcome back to my channel. We've had a well-deserved break, but we are back. And today we are gonna be showing you all there is to do on Gilly Air. So as always, we'll be showing you where to eat, where to stay and what to do. Stay tuned. And on our final two days of this video, we are gonna be showing you one of the best places we have ever stayed. Gilly Air is one of three Gilly Islands located off the shores of mainland Lombok. We travelled here from Nusa Lembongan via boat which took around two and a half hours. We had a little stroll around the east side of the island um, and there's like loads of like cafes and shops and stuff and now we've just stopped somewhere, got a little limeade. It's called Pituk Cafe. It's really cute, we definitely recommend it. I'm sure there's some food as well, so. I'll Cheers. See, actually, if I recommend it after the food. So we've gone, gone for the pumpkin curry wrap. Lewis is going to take a bite and then tell us how it is. Oh wow, well. that's amazing. Wow. Well, it tastes like a, like a Panang curry or something. Mm, nice, okay, my turn. Okay. See you later, guys. So we're just taking a stroll, lips off to get our nails done. Finally. And it's so nice on this island because there are no motorbikes and no cars, so everyone's riding bicycles um, or getting horse and cart around, which is, yeah, it's nice and chill, isn't it? You don't yeah. have to look where you're going every two seconds in case you get run over. Yeah, no, it is nice. Nice vibe, so fun. went quiet there on you guys. Um, I went to try and get my nails done here and it was a complete flop. Then we just came back and chilled by the hotel pool, which is really, really nice. We'll give you a full tour shortly in this video. So we'll get, as I said, we'll give you a full tour of the hotel tomorrow, but it's called the Coho, I think it's just called the Coho Hotel um, on Gilliere. And yeah, it's really, really gorgeous. Uh, we paid 90 pounds for two nights, so approximately 45 pound a night, which isn't too bad when you're splitting it between two of you. And um, yeah, it's really, really, really beautiful. So somehow we've ended up <laughs> getting a drink and watching the end of the Wales versus Iran game. You can barely even see it, there you go. Well, this place is wide, to be fair. I am Vagus. I am Vagus. Tell us about the beer. I think it's the only place I've seen where they sell draft beer, so the whole time I've been in Indonesia. Allora. Allora. Where are we? <laughs> Allora. <laughs> Yeah, we've just come to a Italian restaurant called Allora, which is rated really highly on Google. We didn't check if it's right but it's rated really highly on Google. And it also looks delicious on Google as well. So really excited for that. And Lewis has just put a light in my eyes, which is great. I'm waiting for your reaction. <laughs> just heading out for food we've had a very very lazy day around the pool we're gonna do the same tomorrow afternoon so we'll show you what the hotel is like during the day but good vibes isn't it yeah hotel. I really like it 
Very, very good vibes. Good value for money. Yeah, it's like £45 a night and it's just class. But we did a bit of snorkeling, which was epic. And we have just booked on for diving. We've got three dives in the next four days. So we're going to do one tomorrow morning at 8.30, Shark Point. Liv is tired, I am starving. So we're heading out for a quick bite to eat. It's sleepy. Monopoly and Rattlers and football. Yes, yes. And the football and burgers. And burgers. <laughs> what a night. And oh, well, no. This is actually the place we were last night, if you don't recognise it. We've come back for food tonight. We've got our burgers. They look so good. Chippies. Chips are awesome. Chips are awesome. There you go. So now we are going to have a little early night and watch a film. Um, yeah, and just get oops, get some sleep for our dive tomorrow. Food was a bit average. <laughs> Burgers were still mooing. Yeah. Sent them back to get them recooked, and they came out still mooing. <laughs> <laughs> but we just saw someone who got the chicken, and that looked really good. Yeah, the so. roast chicken looks amazing. Yeah. And the chips were great, so. Mm. Yeah, I wouldn't I rule we, out. I think we just got a bit unlucky. Home sweet home. Let's see, where would you, why would you want to be anywhere else when this is where you're staying? The restaurant area is so cute as well. Just a little bit. It's a bit of a mess at the moment because we've got our laundry back today. Lewis's favourite time of the week. I feel like we're always on the camera when we're doing laundry. Yeah. But yeah, this is our room. It probably looks way better than this. I'll show you in daylight tomorrow properly. quick room tour we are actually checking out in a minute so it's not the tidiest but it's our room there's a still in bed um, so yeah pretty big room to be honest really comfortable bed cute decor I don't know if we're really selling it right now but I want um, and then inside outside bathroom which is really lovely lots of these in Bali so if you don't love the insects, then maybe just always check if it's inside or outside, but we really like them. It has got a bit of a ceiling there. Um, yeah, shampoo and conditioner, which I appreciate. And yeah, that's it, that's our room. And this is the outside. I think I've done a few shots of this already, but um, yeah, it's really, really, really cute. Like we really like it here. We spent most of our days just relaxing by the pool, which we haven't done the whole trip. It's just too inviting. So all of these like little huts at all the rooms, reception there, like loads of seating areas, bar, we can have breakfast and stuff is here. And then as you go round, there is there are some more rooms this way. Um, and another pool, which is got a pink tile look to it which is really cute as well Come for sunset on the east side of Gilead. We're at a place called Maui. Good views, good vibes. Just biking to day two of time. We're driving cars on a Mars tonight. We're passing up to the Dive in this. Nice. What did we say? Good biz. We lost count of how many turtles. Giant moray eel, which is huge. What else did we see? An octopus. That's about it. Liv finally saw a mantis shrimp. Oh, yeah. Missing about 10. Yep. Um, yeah. That's 
it. Now we've just come to a cafe for Lewis to get some lunch because he did not join me in getting some this morning. And I've just got a little coffee. We've got another dive at 11.30, so we've got about 50 minutes. We're driving cars on a Mars tonight. We're blessing up to the stars tonight. We wanna go. Good afternoon, guys. So this afternoon, oh, this morning, we went on two dives, which were really, really good. And this afternoon we have changed hotels. We are now staying in Villa 2K. We'll give you a full room tour in a little while, but wow, it's like incredible. Definitely like the best place we've stayed in Bali. We've just got ourselves some takeaway pizza from Mum's Pizza. Really good. So a quick room tour of our bamboo villa, which literally, well, hasn't actually properly opened. We are the first people to stay in here and it was finished last night so let's take you on a tour welcome to the swell there. this is the most ridiculous place we have ever stayed absolutely incredible show you around obviously all made out of bamboo so totally up there with the barley vibe Come in, toilet there, and then you come into this huge living area. Sunken living room, yeah, absolute sunken. vibes. Excuse all our camera gear. We've got a cosy little den here. Oh, which I love. My like five year old self is absolutely loving this little den. And then, amazing pool. Goes all the way around each side. Got the hangout area, tea bags. Never want to get back up again. And then into the kitchen. Nice messy kitchen after our pasta and pizza that we just had from Mama's Pizza, which was absolutely banging. Really good. Had a road drone. Nice and easy. Then you come into the dining room. I love these. I just love everything about this villa, like all the rattan and the way it's decorated is a bit of me. Some more sand lounges and then outside shower. Now let's go upstairs. Crazy staircase. Okay, up the bamboo staircase we go. We didn't actually know if we were staying in the bamboo version or there. We've got like normal luxury villas as well. Which we'll show you tomorrow. Yeah, we're moving into ones. So we've got one night in here and one night in the villa tomorrow. So balcony area, looking over the pool and the rest of the villa. 1.5 meter depth, you can jump if you want. I bottled it. <laughs> Might pluck up the courage tomorrow. And we've got the classic barley knitting. I'm gonna give it my best shot. These are never actually as easy as they look to get into. And always make sure you don't have your phone in your pocket. Yeah. Oh, they are comfy though, especially when you've got something to think of you. Yeah, absolute vibes. So we've got two bedrooms in this one. So they have, there's another bamboo house, if you look over there. I think that's a one bedroom. Here we have two. They are pretty much identical, so we'll show you one. So here's all our stuff in the way. Okay, take two, we're going to show you the other bedroom because we've left our actual bedroom in a mess. So, lovely bed. Full length mirror. Liv's managed to climb out the netting so she can continue the tour. <laughs> yeah, gorgeous bed. Full length mirror. Wardrobe space area, desk area, pretty important these days. And then I think maybe my favourite part of the bedroom is the bathroom. A gorgeous shower, I love these tiles so much. And then a sunken bath, I don't think I've ever, ever been in a sunken bath before. And then- A window like you're on a boat. <laughs> And then there's the throne. The throne. <laughs> so 
So we've already shown you this place during the day, but I think it's even better at night time. Take a look at this. a real pinch me moment that we're actually staying here when we booked this trip to Bali I've had like a bamboo house saved on my Airbnb since I don't even know when like five six years ago so when we were coming here one of my things was I really wanted to stay in one and if you remember our Ubud uh, vlog if you haven't watched it here it is. We stayed in a small bamboo house um, to kind of be like, yep, yeah, we did it. We came to Bali and stayed in a bamboo house. And now we're staying in this one and this one is just incredible, like absolutely speechless at this place. Like the best place we've stayed in Bali by a country mile. Good morning from paradise. Good morning. Sleep well in the villa? Yeah, I did sleep really well. Really yeah. Very we were up bright and early to do a shoot, so we've got to shoot these guys some content before we move into another one of their villas today. So we've got four hours, hence Liv is in the fancy black dress. So we're going to do some shooting, then we've got floating breakfast set up, and then there's probably more shooting, and then we'll move and chill for the day. Hello, hello! Just finished doing a bit of shooting and now we've just been enjoying our second floating breakfast in Bali. It was really nice. Let me show you what we had, even though we've eaten half of it already. So, do you want to tell us what we've got? Yeah, well, what there was. Yeah. So I had bacon and eggs, you had pancakes. We've got a cinnamon roll each. This is mango and pineapple smoothie, which I don't think we've got any room for, so that's going in the fridge. Fruit salad, coffee each, juice each. You've got a coconut. Coconut. Uh, yeah, loads and loads of food. Enough for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> <laughs> it was lovely. So the time has come to move out of our mansion bamboo villa, which we're sad about. But we are moving into our neighbours next door which is a smaller version, so let's go and check it out. Smaller villa, maybe smaller, not a smaller version. <laughs> smaller villa, yeah. So these are interconnecting, so if you had a big group of you, you could have two bedrooms in there, one bedroom here, and it also connects on the other side to another one like this. And there's one next door, so there's like options if there's a big group of you. Um, but there's obviously just us two. So you walk in and you've got this lovely kitchen, just a smaller version of what's in there, basically. Still a gorgeous pool curve shape. And then out into the garden. Some sun lounges. That is obviously the official entrance. And then this way is the bedroom. I'll show you the bathrooms first. Toilet. It's me. A nice Outdoor shower, same design as next door. No bath in this one though. No bath, no. So this is the bedroom. It's a lovely really, bedroom, isn't it? Yeah, really gorgeous. Still got the bamboo roof. Yeah, that, yeah, that's actually really, I haven't seen that, that's beautiful. Yeah, got a little chaise lounge in the corner. Yeah, it's really nice. The rattan. Again, yeah, with the rattan. Really nice wall hangings. Bedroom that overlooks the pool. Go straight can, out to the pool. Yeah, you can actually open these up. Jump straight in. Um, a little desk in this one as well. And then you're back in the kitchen. We'll go this way. Yeah. And yeah, it is bamboo. It's got all bamboo roofs and everything. Yeah. It's really, it's really, lovely. really gorgeous. So we're just heading out now. This is the first time we've left in 24 hours because we've just moved out of our bamboo mansion into our smaller bamboo house. And yeah, we're just gonna head out now and grab a bit of lunch. So we've cycled round to Palangi Beach, which is on the north of the island. 
we have come to Legend Bar and we've just got the lunch. What have you gone for? I've gone for the chicken ciabatta and some chips because I'm really hungry. And I've got some fish fingers and spring rolls. So, bon appetit. So the food is great. Time for a beer. Just on our ride back to our villa and we have been blessed with this epic sunset which you can't really see right can't now tell what's but I will show you <laughs> on the next one on the next slide whatever you call it don't worry guys I know how to work Liv's camera here's the sunset for you We have come to Allegria for the final coffee as we wait for the boat to arrive. It's supposedly the best coffee on the island and it looks insane. Thanks so much for tuning into our Gilead vlog. If you like what we do here, then like, share and subscribe so that others can find us and stay tuned for our next video, which will be our final destination in Indonesia. So then we just came back and chilled by the hotel pool. By the... Then we just came back and chilled by the hotel pool. What are we gonna eat? Uh, Alor. Alor. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Um, that's in the door. Um, so yeah, we're, oh wow, it's all summed up. Let's do that again. We're at a place called Maui's. Nice views, good Maui's. vibes. Maui's. 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 Maui's, Maui's, maybe. Good views, good vibes.